Hey guys, it's Chris. Um, I'm doing this quick video, and I'm hoping this is quick. Um, basically, I wanted to discuss in this video um, a very big um, factor when it comes to purchasing wax, as far as I'm concerned. Excuse me, and that is customer service. Um, I have recently purchased from somebody who half their order um, smells like nothing, like soapy wax kind of stuff. Um, they're giving me the runaround. They're not really, you know, can I get a partial refund? I can't do anything until this date, this date, this date, whatever, whatever. Um, really, really bad customer service. Super bad. Um, will I ever order from this vendor again? No, I will not. Um, we will see towards the end of the month if she keeps her promises and makes it right. But um, um, anyway, I'm sorry. Um, but I wanted to give you a um, <clears throat> breakdown of good customer service. I have a vendor that I've purchased from, I just made a big purchase, and I recently did a video, it's Tapa Therapy, um, it's run by the amazing Imesh, if you're looking for bath and body, perfume oils, um, wax, anything like that, this stuff is just amazing, love it, yeah, absolutely, I cannot rave enough about this shop and this vendor, love it. Well, I placed an order from her, and you, um, I mean, if you watch the other video, <clears throat> it was recently, so you can find it, um, a lot of the, she accidentally poured a lot of the scent shots into the wrong cups, so unfortunately, those were cups that I could not use, um, as the fragrance oils had eaten, you know, all the plastic away, and, you know, I mean, I... Like I said, even if I kind of repackaged or did my best to, some of the bottoms were all gooey kind of thing. It was just, I mean, it was an honest mistake. And you know what? She owned up to it. She's like, oh, my God, I had, like, two stacks of scent shots, and I grabbed the wrong one, and, you know, it was totally my fault. I don't like to ask for refunds. I don't like to complain, and I don't like to, you know, I don't like to, unless the wax is absolutely unusable. I don't complain. I'm just not a complainer. I really don't. I just kind of chalk it up to, you know, there's a difference between wax being unusable and wax being like a scent that you don't like. You know what I mean? Something to that effect. That, that's a two totally different things. So if the wax is totally unusable, then I will, you know, address it with the vendor. I may, from Sephotherapy, like beyond above and beyond my expectation. She had this stuff poured, re poured. Um, some of the scents um she didn't have the fragrance oils for, so she gave me a whole list. She looked through her inventory, she spent a lot of time with me, looked through her in inventory to make sure that she had what she, you know, needed. Um gave me a scent list as far as what she had available. I picked from that. So some of the scents were not the same. Uh I didn't necessarily get some of the same scents, but it was fine. I, I mean, I love all her scents. I think they're amazing. But anyway, so this was shipped in, like, I got this in, like, two days. Like, this was two to three days. This was, like, insane. So she not only poured right away, she, ugh, it was just amazing. It was absolutely amazing. Um, so she poured it in the right cups. I don't know if you can see this here, but they're number five PPs. Um, some of the other the other wax from the order was in number five PP. The problem was she had instead of having the scent um her label right here, um instead of having it here, she had it on the bottom. So I couldn't really I couldn't see if it was the correct cups, but it was quite obvious. Um uh, most of the ones that I thought were an issue, I you know, I peeled them off. Um and it was the wrong scent cups. So she was like, Oh, you know, she was thanking me. Like, thank you, the customer, for bringing this to my attention so that I didn't send out any more of those, you know what I mean, and get, you know, all these bad reviews or whatever, have this hassle, whatever. 
she's just amazing. So she poured and um, so I'm just going to show you here. But basically, like I said, this is good customer service. There was no argument or anything like that. There was no excuses. There was nothing. It was like, I will make your order complete. I will make it right. So, and she spent a lot of time with me. This is in um, Fig and Olive. Oh, and it smells amazing. This is a scent that I originally didn't have in my order. Um, but I love anything Fig. So, that was awesome. This is Chocolate Amber. This is also a new one. Um, like I said, she couldn't, she couldn't pour. She couldn't exactly replicate my order. But that was fine by me. You know what I mean? But there was no, like I said, no arguments, no, you know, I mean, I, I'm always willing to take pictures or anything like that, whatever. I mean, she didn't even, like, want that. She was just like, which ones can't you use? I said, give me a few minutes because I'm going to try to pop out the one, pop some out, you know, and put into different cups and see what I can use and what I can't use. And so then I just gave her a list of what I couldn't use. And she said, well, I don't have all of that, all of those scents, but here's what I do have absolutely replace it and I'm sure she probably actually included more than I um <clears throat> than I that than the ones that I couldn't use. But anyway, this is in chocolate amber. This was a new scent. Um oh, and this smells heavenly. I oh my god, this smells so good. And this is only gonna smell better on here. And I am just like I said, I am in love with her wax. I'm in love with all her stuff actually. Um like I said, Bath and Body Works, all this other stuff. I just, I love it. Um, fragrance oils. This one is in Blackberry Sage. This was one that I do believe um, I had placed an order for. It smells so good. Oh, my God. Like, I can totally catch the Blackberry and the Sage. And I have melted her wax, so I can attest that it is to die for. I've said it in other videos, in the other video, um, the first video that I received, that if you have not purchased from Therapy, you have to. You must. Like, it is a must. My One of my top three vendors. Absolutely. Like, no doubt about it. This is in Pink Lemonade. This is one that I didn't originally have picked, but it was on the list, so I picked it. And this stuff was recently poured. This was poured, well, this was an um, 8-4. So she kind of wanted to get my order out really quick. So she gave me a list of, like, okay, if you want to wait a couple days, I can, I'm can. i waiting on fragrance oils, or if you want them right away, kind of thing, whatever. So anyway, so some of these were already poured. Some of these are were just poured. Like this one, that one was 8-4. This one is 9-4. So this one was just poured. This is in chocolate layer cake. Um... Again, number five PP. Oh my god. Like I said, I just love I'm not gonna go through set descriptions or anything. But like I said, this is mainly a customer service um um video. I love how she puts the four dates on there, so you always know. I always care for a month. Um this is sweet cornbread. All her stuff is is hundred percent eco friendly soy. So all she uses is soy. Um, for, um, like, scoopables, she'll put soybean oil in, organic so soybean oil at that, and, um, fragrance oil. So, and usually it's, a, sometimes it's essential, sometimes it's just regular, you know, essential fragrance oils, whatever. Um, everything is eco-friendly and 100% natural, and, oh my god, I just love it. So this was in Sweet Corn Bread. Oh, god, to die for. I love cornbread. Absolutely love it. Um, my boyfriend's going to be over soon. He's probably going to want to be sniffing everything. Um, <laughs> this is, okay, so this is how she originally had her labels on the bottom as opposed to on the lids. And I'm going to be honest, I like, I prefer it. So I may, if you watch this, I prefer them on the bottom. Um, but the problem was I couldn't see what kind of, like, if this was a number 5 PP, I couldn't see that. But I do, if if you're sure it's a number 5 PP, I prefer it on the bottom. That way, if the lid ever pops off in transit, I know what this is. You know what I'm saying? Like, if this lid pops off, this one pops off, you know, oops. Or if a couple of them pop off, say these two pop off, how do I know which is which? Is which? You know what I mean? I prefer them on the bottom. 
that's just my personal preference. You know, you run your shop the way you've been running it, I may, because it's amazing. Um, but again, this is another chocolate amber. I think she had three of these. I said, I'll take all three just because it sounds so amazing and it is amazing. Um, people are asking too on some of the, oh yeah, here's another chocolate amber. See, these, these lids don't stand very well. I have yet to find, because I have these black kind. I don't know if it's the same company. I don't know if they're by Dart. And I got them off Amazon. And the um, they seem to stay really well. I, I don't know. The kind of the brand that I got, but when I went back to get more, they didn't, the seller, you know, said, oh, seller no longer makes these or whatever, or isn't selling these, whatever. These lids tend to pop off really easily. And, you know, so when you're, put them in the, your drawers or whatever, it's kind of difficult, but whatever. So like I said, I like the labels on the bottom. I like them on the cup somewhere, um, as opposed to on the top, as opposed to on the lid, because when the lids pop off, pop off, pop off, who knows. This is banana walnut cake. This, um, this was just recently poured also. Oh my god, it smells so good. Oh my god, and, and her scents are right on, like, if it says blackberry sage, I can smell blackberry and I can smell sage. It, and people were asking about unusual scents. Um, I know that um, there's a couple vendors that do, like, really, see, this one kind of popped off. So, and it's on the lid. So, unfortunately, see, see, these lids don't want to stay. And you know what the problem, I think, is? And this is like a total rant, I know. But this has nothing to do with, with stuff with therapy, but is that they sell the the um the actual cups separate from the tops. So I happened to find um number five PP on Amazon that sold the tops and the bottom. So they fit really, really well. But when you have to buy the top separately, they tend to not I don't know. They just don't tend to fit right. Even though it's the same company. I don't know. It's really weird. But um this is in black Irish really good. This kind of reminds me of like a Irish spring almost. But I'm sure, like I said, this is just poured on the third. So I'm sure once the spring is going to smell differently. But people were asking, I know I keep going back to this, like different scents, more unusual scents, the things you might not like mix together, whatever. Um, I think Sapotherapy is one of those vendors. Um, chocolate Walnut Espresso. Like, hello, everybody knows I'm, like, all over this. Um, and like I said, I've said before, nothing irks me more when I can't smell. If it's called chocolate walnut espresso, I want to smell chocolate, I want to smell walnut, and I want to smell espresso. And this is to die for. And this was only poured on the fourth. So when I let this sucker cure, oh, my God. Amazing. Amazing, amazing. Um, she will tell you, too, that her forte is Bath and Body. Um, I think it's about three years ago, I think she said she started getting more into candles. See, this one's not staying on either. Some of these black ones aren't staying on. But um, she started getting into candles and stuff like that. But she is amazing. And now she's, now she's got scoopables. She's got, like, squirt wax. or That's not her name for it. But, oh, my God. Just, I can't, like I said. I can't get enough. I really can't. Um, and this is Mediterranean fig. I love the smell of fig, you guys. Oh, my God. Fig is just... Oh. Fig is so good. Is fig like a seasonal scent? Oh. The top broke. That's okay. I, I have other tops. But for some reason, these tops are not fitting onto these black ones very well. But see, like, you think they're universal, right? Like, they all should fit on the same cups. That's how they get you. You know what I mean? They want you to pay, like, 60 bucks for a case of the, of the cups. And then you think, oh, they're going to come with the lid. No, you have to pay extra for the lid. I just know that from experience. What a pain in the butt. Um, and the last one is Runestone. And again, this, this will not stay on. This is, this doesn't fit. Um, this top, but that's okay because, like I said, I have other tops. So, um, Runestone, this was only paying on the third. I have no idea what this even was, but I loved oh, this. Is so good. Oh my god, there's so many of these scents that I have to get scoopable. 
I have to. Um, now, the only thing, like I said, I would advise, I may, at all, is the stickers. Put them on the bottom. Like, like you did this one. Put them on the bottom of the cup. Much, 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 much better. Um, top of the cup, a lot of these lids are popping off. They're not really staying. They're not, like, you know, they're not staying. And, you know, if you put them, you know, when you send them, what happens if they all pop off? And then you don't, you have no idea what they are. This rune stone is amazing. Um, so, yeah. So, anyway, that is my quick video on customer service. You want really good, amazing customer service? Sapotherapy, you want amazing wax, sapotherapy, you want amazing bath and body, sapotherapy, you want amazing lip glosses, sapotherapy, you want amazing fragrance oils, sapotherapy, perfumes, roll on perfumes, sapotherapy. I, I, okay, hello, can I say it anymore? You guys gotta go. I'm gonna put her information below. I may thank you for the replacements. I love you, darling. I truly, truly, truly do love you. I, I thank you for taking the time with me you know, to make my order, you know, um, satisfactory, and you were just above and beyond, because you could have said, okay, hey, I'll send you 13 of whatevers, you know what I mean, and you didn't, you let me pick what I wanted, you, you know, you were willing to pour, just amazing, I love you, and I, I, like I said, if I could hold up a sign, or put a banner on my front lawn that says, buy stop therapy, I would, because, I live in a condo association, unfortunately, I can't do that, but I would, I would do it for you, because I love it, love it, love it, love it, so everybody have a great night, I'll talk to you soon.